And welcome back to- what am I holding up? Oh, right. I got this while fishing. Anyways, welcome back to Let's Play Stardew Valley. Guess who accidentally deleted some footage? Uh, fortunately we only lost like two days worth of footage and all I really did was fish and I got- Oh, right. Uh, I took in my pickaxe and finally got upgraded to Iridium. It should be ready today, actually. Anyways, what's up with you, Leia? Alright, not much. Hi, cheese. Just playing in the corner with your blocks. Where'd you get those blocks, actually? I don't remember ever buying those. Oh, cheese is ready. Well, the cheese in the basement, not my baby. Uh, do you have anything else I can put in there right now? I have goat cheese, but I want to give that to Robin. You know what? Nah. Robin, we can just give her, like, some beer or something. But yeah, uh, in the last two days, I basically just took care of the farm, took my pickaxe in. I'm trying to think what else we missed. Oh, hey, a bream. Oh, right, and I found this while fishing. We're gonna go donate that later. And hopefully my pickaxe is done, because I want to get these uh, broken open. And finally we got a duck feather. Actually, now that I think about it, when was the last time we got- Hey, broke the fence. Uh, when was the last time we got, like, a duck feather? Actually, it's been quite a while. Which is surprising considering I have three ducks. Actually, I need to be even maxed out on hearts. I kind of haven't really been hugging my ducks that much. Eh, that might explain- No. That might explain it. When you get this many chickens, it starts becoming a problem to try to hug them all. Kind of got way too many animals in, like, a really tight spot. It might be easier if I, like, start expanding my field a bit. Oh well, we'll deal with that later. Alright, so let's just get all these eggs going. Oh wait, I don't want to screw up my inventory. Also, at some point I should probably get more copper, because I think I realized something. Uh, winter is coming at, with the fact that we're gonna need fodder. And right now, 240 fodder probably won't last that long. Like, how many animals do I have? Here, let me take a quick inventory. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. And then over here... Uh, okay, we don't have enough fodder. But I think I have, like, around 20 animals. And that's 240 pieces of fodder when full. That's gonna equal about... Let me see. Also, I should probably be milking you before I hug you. Just so I can keep track. Uh, what was I thinking about? Alright, calculation. So, 20 animals plus... So that's 20 a day. That would be like 12 days worth of fodder. I probably don't have up to 20 animals, but still. A second silo is probably a good idea. Also, I might want to grab more grass starters. Alright, did I get all my uh, cows? I think I did. Actually, wait, I think I missed like one or two down here. No, I think I got them all. But yeah, I think I'm gonna grab a second silo. I know I need clay, copper, and... I think it's stone. I don't think we need wood for it. At least I'm assuming that's how a second silo will work. I honestly have never actually built a second silo before. Usually I just buy my fodder. But we are trying to save money in the long run. If I'm ever gonna get that return staff, we're gonna need money. Also, did I get all the milk going yet? Yeah, I did. So let's go check the brewery, and then we're gonna run to the blacksmith, because it should be ready today. Uh, I put it in two days ago. Hopefully Clint's been working on it. And then we're gonna go get more copper, because we only have like two bars. And I think it's five uh, is what we need for another, for a silo. Oh, hey, hey, plants are done. More money for me. Uh, no pine resin yet. I would get another tapper, but we are already kind of almost to capacity with the, uh, shed over there. No ancient fruit. Never mind, I lied. One ancient fruit. And more cranberries. Alright, so that's all the farm work taken care of. Let's sell what we don't need and then get, then, uh, get going. I was thinking of going to the casino today, but that, then I remembered I didn't change my resolution, and I can't exactly do that in the middle of a recording without screwing everything up. 
Alright, let's go. Off to town. Oh, before we go to town, actually, let me see what I need to do this week. Uh, Robin, we need to get another heart for. Jas, we need to get two more hearts for. And yeah, I think we're gonna befriend Linus. Problem is, what does Linus like? Probably food. Do we have any food on us that isn't beer? Actually, he might like beer. Who knows? Anyways, is it done yet? It is done. Awesome. Iridium. Now my pickaxe is purple and will break everything. Awesome. And while we're here, anything new? I think we've seen that before. Yep, that's just slate. And that's an earth crystal. Alright. Actually, we could... Oh, we should save money. It's not that hard to find copper. How many more do I need? So, we need three more. Fifteen. So, we need eleven more. Eh, shouldn't be too difficult. Although, if I'm ever going to go back to the skull mines, I think we're just going to buy, like, another hundred pieces of copper. And make, like... 50 cherry bombs. Actually, for 50 cherry bombs, I think that's 150 pieces of copper. Either way, we're gonna get a lot of bombs again. Let's see, copper 20th? 20th floor should be good? Oh, never mind. Actually, no, I need the combat experience, even though these aren't really worth that much. There we go. And I left some bug meat behind. Alright, so let's see, copper. I see some. Let's grab that. Any more copper in the area? Nobody found the stairs. Oh, here we go. But yeah, this pickaxe should be able to pretty much break everything in a single hit. If not, there is not really much further we can go. And by that I mean we can't go any further. And by break everything in one hit, I mean the single blocks. The big ones will still take like three hits. And then the ones in the skull mine are a bit tougher, I believe. Uh, no more copper. We should probably go to the skull mine tomorrow. I do want to get my combat and my mining to level 10. And then all we'll have to focus on is uh, forging, which that might still take a while, and uh, what is it? Oh, and fishing. Fishing is going to be the painful one. We're going to need to find a good place to fish. Actually, I think the ancient, or not the ancient woods, the uh, hidden woods would be a good place for that. Because we just need to find somewhere with consistently strong fish. But not too strong. Otherwise it'll take forever and I won't be able to catch anything. I mean, I have been fishing more off screen, like in between episodes, but... Still, we are starting to get close to winter. Like what, there's less than a week left of the season, actually. Oh, hi, bug. Hmm, any stairs or any more copper? Nope. Let's find those stairs. Actually, wait, why are we in the mines? Let's go back to the quarry. That's kind of the reason the quarry's there. Uh, hopefully there's copper there. Or something good. Because, yeah, I'm not finding the stairs anytime soon. Oh, there's some copper. How much do I have? Oh, I have more than enough copper now. Never mind. Eh, might as well head to the quarry anyways. Never know. Might be something good there. Or it might just be rocks. Wow, there's not even any copper. Or iron. All I can see is like a topaz stone, which... Eh, we might as well get in an amethyst stone. Alright. Well, that was a bit of a bust. Let's head home. Also, I want to go see if I can find, uh... What's his name? Linus. And Robin. We should see Robin. Oh, wait. There he is. Do you like... Actually... Do you like spicy eel? I made it my- no way, no I didn't make it myself. Oh good, you do. I found it in a dragon. Okay, I killed a dragon and it fell out of it. I am still not 100% sure how that works. Unless those dra dragons are actually eels that happen to cook themselves onto a dish every time I kill them. Maybe I'm, or maybe I'm cooking them with my sword. That made sense on the last sword I had, which was the lava katana. I kind of doubt the galaxy sword can cook stuff. Although, you never know. Maybe the power of the galaxy is like a sun or something. Hi, worms. Eh, seeds. While we're here... 
We could stand on the train tracks and wait for a train, but no. Oh, I think I know what I want to try. Uh, what was it that we needed for that bun that summons monsters at night? Or not bun. Actually, was it a strange bun? Anyways, what do we need to use to basically get that? Because I think that would be a good way to grind experience for combat. Strange bun monsters. Hmm. On the other hand, it would be a shortcut. On Why did I come out here? Actually, we could probably see Jazz while we're down here, too. On the one hand, it is a kind of a shortcut, but on the other hand, I don't know if we can reverse it. And I would rather be able to work outside of my farm without having to worry about getting killed. Plus, you know, monsters kind of bring down the property value. And the fact that I have kids wandering around. Leia would probably not be very happy with me if I brought monsters onto the farm. Yeah, we should hold off on it. Also, I didn't give anything to, uh, what's her name? To Robin today. Oh, that's three. I was hoping for one. Although, we could just wait to, till we, like, get some more goat cheese. Also, why are we carrying monster meat with us? There we go. Also, grab some hardwood. Never know what we needed for. Actually, at this point, it might be better just to, like, replace all my fences with hardwood fences. Because we have, we could just gather a ton of hardwood for it. It's not that hard to get. And it would be definitely an improvement of, like, my wood, not my wooden fences, my, uh... My stone fences, which keep falling apart. That's not a bad long-term idea. Here, I'm gonna go home and check, check my uh, inventory of hardwood. We're gonna need a lot of it. Probably, like, over a hundred, honestly. I don't think we have that much yet. Also, it's got, it just got lighter in here. Weird. Anyways, let's just go see if we can find Jast and then head home. Tomorrow, I'm thinking of maybe going out to the Skull Mine. We do need to, like, completely restock on Iridium. We're 100% out again. And I do want to upgrade my axe at some point. And maybe at some point I should also upgrade this hoe that I've been hanging on to. Also, I think it's too late to see Jast. We'll come see her tomorrow. Because, yeah, I have not upgraded my hoe at all. I'm going to need copper for that. Oh, hey. That's a truffle. And is my inventory full? Yep. Don't need fiber. Or seeds. Or seaweed. Or algae, whatever. Actually, wait. Where did I get that algae? I don't remember picking that up. Cheese. Uh, all normal cheese today. Ooh, wait. What can I throw out that I don't need? Sap. Four pieces of wood. Slime. And these stones aren't really worth that much, honestly. And then we can just get that processed. Alright, and any more eggs? Nope, we're good. We'll grab that tomorrow morning. Oh, that's another truffle. Give me that. I don't even see those things spawning. Oh, that was two truffles. My pigs are doing good work. Kinda wish my rabbit would do good work and give me a foot. Even though we don't need it anymore. At this point, it's just kind of the principle of the thing. It's mocking me. I can feel it. Why are we keeping that rabbit around? Because it's a rabbit. It's adorable. No point throwing away a perfectly good rabbit. Alright, so let's sell what we don't need tonight. No, not the engine fruit. I'm going to turn that into wine. Uh, let's see. That. And everything else I will keep. I'm going to keep the duck feather to give to Jazz, because I know that's like one of the gifts she loves. Or at least really likes. Oh, we got wine. What do we have? Ancient fruit, ancient, ancient. Pomegranate, ancient, and grape. I like how grape wine is the boring one. Huh. Actually, do I have anything else I can put in these? Where's all my coffee? Actually, I think I'll put that in storage. One second. Might as well put something in there. Uh, there's my coffee. I have a lot of coffee. And ancient seeds. Oh, I think I remember what I wanted to do with these ancient seeds. Oh, but I don't think I have any good fertilizer, though. Do I? Do I have any high-quality fertilizer? 
Uh, I have two. Hmm. Do I have any fish? Also, I forgot. Last time I also bought a new hat. It's a Bulmer hat. Because we made a million gold. Uh, total. Not in one day. That would be insane. Probably possible if you, like, saved up enough, but insane. Anyways, we have some ancient fruit seeds. I want to start replacing my cranberries with those. Or some coffee. With Honestly, the coffee would be better to replace, because... Yeah, we have way too much coffee. I, yeah, I was thinking of replacing some of my cranberries, but then I remembered something. I had to throw away, like, over a hundred coffee into the shipping box. We have too much coffee. Alright, so let's ship what we don't need. Oh, I also wanted to get some coffee going. And then, bed. While I try to decide what I want to do tomorrow, the mine is a good choice, but I'm going to need copper. And coal. And bombs. Actually, wait. What do we need for the big bomb again? I know it's gold. It's oh, right. I actually, wait. Normal bombs just take iron, right? For... But copper is cheaper in the long run. And if you use, like, good placement, they're pretty much exactly the same. Not horrible. Also, you know what? I think every night... I'm going to start putting down random pieces of furniture. So let's see. I don't feel like a chair. Let's find something for the wall. Hmm. A hanging shield would be good. Ooh, a miner's crest. Or a window. Actually, wait. This is perfect. It is almost Christmas. I think. Let's start decorating the place for Christmas. Anyways, bedtime. And by almost Christmas, I mean in real life. I'm assuming this is coming out sometime in late November, early December. I've kind of completely lost track of when these episodes are going up. That's the problem with recording so much in advance. And it's raining today. Hi, Cheese. Oh, wait, it's raining today. We should probably go, like, start cutting down some more fodder. Because I don't think we have enough to feed all the animals. Also, I should probably actually do something with this room other than fill it with TVs. But that just shows we're well off. That and I accidentally bought a normal TV before. Don't judge me. I'm gonna eat some beer. We can't eat beer, right? We can. Also, if we want to, we could just use a pickaxe to take out whatever's in there right now. But I want to get everything up to iridium level. That being said, it probably isn't worth it to uh, get all my wine up just because it takes two seasons. Oh wait, I missed one. Pumpkins are still not done. Hopefully they'll be done soon. Oops. Let's see, some cranberries, good. Also, I did find out something between episodes. Uh, you know how sometimes when we go to Pierre's shop, we, sell, we see him selling cranberries? That's because sometimes he's like, sell a whole bunch of one thing. Uh, he'll start stocking in his store. And by that I mean if you start selling a bunch of one things directly to him. I don't think it mean I don't think I mean uh, when you ship it. That being said, we have sold a lot of cranberries. Like almost too many cranberries. Don't give me that. We may have ruined the market for cranberries forever. I like to think that's why cranberries were nerfed, even though I'm pretty sure that's because everyone used them. Just because they were so profitable for so long. Oh well, also the game seems to be lagging for some reason. I don't think it likes the rain. Also, I missed this. No, don't eat it. That would be... What would raw tr Just like a giant truffle taste like? Probably very truffly. Actually, how would you describe the flavor of a truffle? Fungusy? That sounds disgusting. Hi, Daikon. Still no feet, huh? Well, one day. Oh, nope. Give me that back. Oh, right. I also wanted to go take a look at how many uh, 
How much hardwood I have. I'll check that in a second. Is that all my eggs? Nope, missed one. Alright, and then I think we have some wool. Hey everybody! Here, let's grab the fodder then. So how much do we need? Hopefully there's enough, because that's all I have. Actually, yeah, it's funny. Oh, I probably should have you. Bleh. I probably should have gotten that copper join last night. Oh well, it's copper. It'll take like what an hour in game. There we go. All right. So who have I not gotten yet? I got star fruit. Got pear. I said I got pear. Didn't get melon yet. But yeah, the system I've gone down is basically after I milk them, I hug them. And that way, I know if I milked them before. Because when all your cows start looking the same, you kind of have to start doing that. Kind of hard to tell the difference between, uh, between them. Uh, I think I have some more milk. Nope, that's all the milk we have. Hmm. The mine does seem like... You know what, no. We're going to wait until next time before going to the skull mine. Just because uh, when we do that, I do want to change my resolution to see if I can access the shop at the casino. Because it would probably be a good idea to do that. And in that case, I think I might just end the episode here and make it a bit of a shorter episode. You know what, no. Let's go a bit further. I think I'm going to go see Robin real quick, see if I can get that silo going. Actually, if we're going to do that... Let us get that going. Should be done in what? Uh, an hour? Hopefully. Plus, I think the rain is really screwing up the game for some reason. It seems to be doing that more often ever since uh, 1.1 came out. I don't know why, but the rain, the computer just, my computer just does not like the rain. Which is a shame, because I love the rain. Oh, it's done already. Alright, so we have clay, copper... You know what? Let's go see Robin right now. And I don't feel like kicking my horse. I'm walking. And then off screen I'll do more, some more fishing and try to level that up. What are our levels right now? Mining, fishing, and combat. Oh, and foraging need to be uh, maxed out. That's gonna take a bit of grinding. That very last level before hitting 10 is... Takes forever for everything except farming. Mostly because farming is the easiest thing ever to level up because you do it every single day. Unless for some reason you don't farm in this game. In which case, I question how you're playing this game because that's like the one way to make money. Well, only one of the ways, but one of the best ways to make money. Alright, so second silo. Yep, we have everything. Let's build it. Where can I put? I could put it right here, but I don't think Leia would like it if we blocked off her art area. That's not a bad place either. Is there anywhere else I can put it that won't be like... Hmm. Actually, down here? Uh, that would be kind of out of the way. It would look weird. Actually, right here is perfect. Although, wait, no. It, it would block like my view of my crops, wouldn't it? Let me see. How big is that? Yes, I'm using my fingers. Yeah, that would be blocking, like, this area of the uh, field for me to look at. Nah. Is there anywhere over here we can put it? Here wouldn't be a horrible spot. Hmm. We can move it later. Why not? Let's stick it right there. And with that, I think I'll end the episode here. So, next time on Let's Play Stardew Valley, hopefully we can go gambling. And actually, you know, talk to the cashier instead of being crippled by... I was going to say shyness, but we're kind of being crippled by the UI, which is a type of shyness, I guess. The fact that we can't look at her because we're too busy looking at our clock. Anyways, till then.